Hey guys, Katie with Girl About Library here, and I wanted to talk about something I did a little differently this month. And that is signing up for Book of the Month Club. If you haven't heard of a Book of the Month Club, honestly, I'll be surprised if you haven't, because it is insanely popular. I have seen it everywhere between YouTube and Instagram and all of the bookish internet places. It is definitely one of the most popular book subscription options. So I want to talk about why I finally did it. I made the plunge. I joined Book of the Month Club. Um, why I did that and the coupon code that I used in order to join. I will have a link below where you can sign up yourself for Book of the Month Club if any of this sounds intriguing to you. I do get a free book credit when you sign up through my link. Thank you so much for my if you do decide to do that. And in fact, let me know below. Let me know below if you sign up um, because I would love to like thank you personally or give you some kind of shout out when I film the video review for the book that I received with the extra credit from you signing up. So like I said, this is my first book of the month club box that I had gotten and I've heard about this forever, so the reasons I hadn't joined. The biggest one is that I am just not that into spending a bunch of money on, what am I doing with my hands? I'm not that into spending a bunch of money on books, and I didn't have all of the information, I didn't know how much it costs, and I believe I signed up for $8.99 a month. So to me, for $8.99 a month, considering this book is $26 if I were to go to the bookstore and get it, which I would never do, likely, in real life, but um, I got it for $8.99, and that is, to me, a super reasonable amount to pay for a new hardcover book. The reason why I don't usually have to spend very much money on books is because I am dedicated to my local library, um, and I'm also, I guess in a way, like, I'm, I'm really lucky to live in a city where there isn't that much competition for the new books that are coming to the library. Um, if there is a waiting list, it's usually less than 10 or 15 people, and so I'm able to get the book within one to three months of the book coming out. But thanks to booktube and Instagram and all of the bookish places, I now have a long list of books that I want to read each month and unfortunately sometimes my library doesn't have them. They just haven't ordered them yet and so on top of having to wait for the library to, to accept the request that I am filling out for them to order the book, then I have to wait for the book to come in, and then I have to wait for them to shelve it, and oh, it just, it takes forever. And I do not have that kind of patience for getting new releases. So as a girl of a library, I was torn between wanting to get new books at the library because obviously that's significantly cheaper than going to the bookstore and purchasing them, but also really being excited about and interested in these new releases. God bless coupon codes. I cannot tell you how many times, I mean pretty much now every time I go to a store, I'm gonna sound so cheap. <laughs> Whatever. Full disclosure, typically when I'm making a purchase in a store, I check Retail Me Not. It is an app that I have on my phone, but it's also a website that you can go to, and they have coupon codes for both in-store purchases, but also online purchases. Like literally the other day I was in Old Navy, and while waiting in line, pulled up a coupon code for 20% off. It's just, it's like, it's just something I do now when I'm in line to make a purchase. It's like a reflex now to get on Retail Me Not and see if there's a coupon code because like nine out of 10 times, there is a coupon code that I can pull up and who doesn't want to save money? Everyone, everyone wants to save money. So the coupon code that I signed up with is REV3. Because I used that coupon code, I got an extra book credit as well as a tote bag and this tote bag is super cute it's very nice material um and now everyone can know how dorky i am when i go outside which is rare oh really i mean it's it's very nice and i that was one of my motivators besides the free book credit but the free book credit was really like the biggest thing to me because 8.99 a month for a, a book to me is awesome but to be able to get four books for $8.99 a month, even better. I also got, let's see, there was all kinds of stuff in there. There is a coloring book that came with it. You can sign up, I guess it probably rotates every couple of months, but they had like a free, I started coloring. Um, they had a coloring book that you could get and they also have a bookmark 
with a note from the person who chose that book for the month. It says, put your Gossip Magazine subscriptions on hold. You won't want to read anything until you're done with this novel about a former Hollywood it girl telling all. Um, and I picked The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo as my book for the month of June. There, every book that was on the list though, honestly was a book that I would have read. So if you're worried that you're gonna sign up for it and you're not gonna like any of the books, you can actually skip a month if none of the books interest you. If you usually read adult fiction or nonfiction, you will be able to find a book, I'm sure. And for me, this is a book that I was excited about reading and I talked about in my June books to check out. And so I was super psyched to see this as one of the options. So another code that I saw floating out there while I was doing my Retail Me Not research was free book. And with free book, you actually get three extra books when you sign up, but the three books are already picked for you. And I'll have a list below of what those books are if that coupon code interests you. And again, I will have a link below where you can sign up for Book of the Month Club. I do get a free book credit when you sign up through my link. And like I said earlier, please let me know if you do sign up for the service because of this video. One, I would love to find out what books you picked, but two, I want to be able to say thank you personally because I get a free book credit when you sign up through my link. And I think that is awesome. Let me know below also if you are already a Book of the Month Club member, how long you've been doing it, and if you stayed past that first three months. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching it, and hit the subscribe button to get more videos like this. Have a great day. Bye.